Hey everyone, it's That Math Magician, and on this video, we're gonna talk about angle relationships. Now, there are many different types of angle relationships. In this video, we're gonna focus on our first two. Now, the first angle relationship I wanna focus on are called complementary angles. And what complementary angles are, they are angles that add up to 90 degrees. Okay, they're angles that create a 90 degree or a right angle. So let's go ahead and write that down. Complementary angles, they add up to 90 degrees. Okay, so all we're thinking about is two, three, four, maybe five angles that when you put them together, they create a 90 degree or a right angle. So let's take a look at an example. Here I'm gonna create this right angle, but the right angle is being cut in half. Now I'm gonna put some points on these uh, lines here. I'm gonna put an A there, this will be the vertex B, put another point C right here, and then down here we'll have point D, okay? Now we know, or we're looking here, we see that we have created a 90 degree or a right angle. We could say for this angle, the measure of angle A, B, D, right? This is A, B, D, this right angle, we know that it equals 90 degrees, okay? Now let's go ahead and focus on one of the smaller angles that's inside this right angle. So let's take a second and look at the measure of angle CBD. I'm gonna go ahead and trace that so we know what we're talking about. C to B to D. So I'm talking about this red angle that's kind of on the bottom of this right angle. And let's say that we know that the measure of the angle CBD, let's say that it is 65 degrees. Okay, doesn't look like it's 65 degrees, but we're gonna say that it is 65 degrees. Now, we're saying here that the measure of angle CBD, and now we're also gonna say that the measure of angle ABC, okay, we know that they add up to 90 degrees. They are forming that right angle. So we're calling these two angles that we have, our red angle, that is CBD, our blue angle, that's ABC. Since we know that they form this 90 degree angle, they are called complementary angles. So complementary angles add up to 90 degrees. So if I know that this red angle down here is 65 degrees, in order to find out my missing blue angle here, or the measure of angle ABC, since I know that they both add to 90, then let's just take that 90 degrees, let's subtract out the part that we know, 65 degrees, and then we're left with our angle at ABC measuring 25 degrees. That is what complementary angles are all about, okay? They are two angles, could be three, could be four, but they're angles that add up to 90 degrees, okay? Complementary angles. All right, that is our first angle relationship. Let's go ahead now and look at our second angle relationship for this video, and that is what we're gonna call supplementary angles, okay? Again, very similar to what we just learned about complementary angles, but for supplementary angles, there is a difference, and that difference is, is that these guys add up to 180 degrees. Okay, a little different from our counterpart, the complementary angle. They added to 90 degrees, they formed a right angle. Here for supplementary angles, they're going to form 180 degrees. Now, 180 degrees, that is just a straight line. Right, if you think about it this way, if I were to draw this right smack dab in the middle, we see that this is a right angle on this side, another right angle on the left side, well 90 and 90, they make 180 degrees. So a straight line, 
is just 180 degrees. Now let's say that I had two angles making up this straight line. Let's go ahead and put some points on here so we can label these angles. We'll call this one L, we'll call this one M, P, and N. Now we know that the measure of angle LMN equals 180 degrees. That is the straight line here. That is this angle when you go all the way around. It's half of a circle, so it's 180 degrees, okay? Now, let's say that we know that the measure of angle LMP, okay, let's trace that so we know what we're talking about. L to M to P. Okay, we're talking about this left angle here, this red angle. Let's say that we know that this angle is 115 degrees. Okay, we know that this left angle here is 115 degrees. We wanna now find out what's the measure of angle NMP. So NMP, right, I'm tracing it out. N to M, M to P. We're trying to find out now what this blue angle, right, the angle on the right, what that's gonna equal. But again, we're being told here that LMP and NMP, they're forming supplementary angles. They're forming supplementary angles because they both are a part of this straight line. So since they make up the straight line, they add to 180. So again, I wanna find my missing angle. All I have to do is take 180 degrees, subtract out the part that I know, which is 115 degrees, and we get that our answer here is 65 degrees. Those are our first two angle relationships that we wanna focus on. Complementary angles are angles that add up to 90 degrees. Supplementary angles are angles that add up to 180 degrees. Okay, we got our right angle and we got our straight line. All right, it's that math magician, and I'll see you on the next video.